I thought I was done with the DLCs, I think I am with the major ones, but there is one last big one and, you know, just to complete the set, why not? Darkspawn Chronicles. In Ferelden's final hours, the Archdemon sets the Darkspawn Horde upon the great city of Denarim. You are a Herlock Vanguard, born to lead and eager for blood. Oh, narrator. The Archdemon's whispers compel you forward, compel you to kill. Recruit a thrall, Vanguard. Assist the Ogre. Kill the Defenders. Right, so this is apparently some kind of an alternate what-if scenario. What if the Darkspawn won in the last battle against Denarim? Recruiting Thralls. Use the Enthrall ability to force Darkspawn into your command. Okay. Three Thralls. Yeah, I'm a vanguard. I'm like a... I'm a warrior. Enthrall. Okay, sweet. Oh! I've got the DLC stuff. I'm a... I'm a one-handed warrior. You know what? Do it. Just make it easier for myself. Whatever. <laughs> I'm good. Thanks. Thanks. None of this... Well, my understanding is that nothing we're doing here is gonna carry over just because... Well, it's not even the Warden, right? This is just a random character here. So... We'll keep the Vanguard armor. Sure, why not? I don't got money, but I got a lot of random stuff. Grimoire of Frozen Wastes. Attributes. Sure, why not? Level up! I'm a level 12 warrior. Can I help us win? Enthrall. We must lead Vanguard recruit these thralls to serve us. Our thralls respect only power. Show them Vanguard was born to lead. Thralls respect leaders who demonstrate ferocity in battle. As you or your thralls kill opponents, each thrall's approval will increase. After 20 points, they will become more powerful. Let's go, thrall. Mmm, Darkspawn don't talk. So this is gonna be um unvoiced. DLC, unfortunately, but I'll, uh, I'll make up for it! Let's go! Let's get some of these people. Yeah! Just the usual warrior abilities. Yeah, now I have a Hurlock, too. Sweet. And the activate defenses and all that. Mabari Warhound! Get him! I don't remember how to play a one-handed warrior. We did in the very beginning for Wellens, but that was so long ago. <laughs> yes, people are getting stronger. Ogre! Get the ogre! Ogre's death is near. Slay his tormentor's vanguard and make him our thrall. Someone injured, did it say? Y'all coming to help? Yeah! Let's go, ogre! Where are you going? No, not over here. Go over here. Vanguard, show the humans that their barricades will not protect them from our fury. Ogres can destroy barricades using Hurl Rock. Yes. We have... Ram, smash, stomp, grab, hurl. Fantastic. Probably don't want to kill some of our dudes, though. Let's grab this dude. Oh, that's beautiful. But uh, I think the people dying is normal, right? Like the Genlocks dying. That's why they're like, oh, you might have to enthrall new ones if they die. Man at arms. I might be able to heal them if the battle stops, but the battle's not stopping. No, these are the regular... Right, these are the regular codex entries. Get him! 
All right, are you guys all right? Do you need healing? Can I heal you? Will you just heal yourself? Or does the battle never end? Are you healing? Oh yeah, they heal. They heal. Cool. Let's chill out for a second. God knows the humans could need the rest, huh? Because apparently in this timeline... I don't know. The Grey Wardens just suck. And they're not getting anything done? Okay, Ogre. Time to show off your rock hurling abilities. Let's go. Uh, but not that soon. Oh, beautiful. Who are these men at arms? Not soldiers, but they're helping. Helping the army. Friendly fire possible. Sorry, Genlock. I do get the sense that the Darkspawn are coordinated enough that they don't usually get their own guys. I might be wrong. But that's the impression I get. No, everyone's too close now. Maybe let's grab somebody. Can you grab a guy? Ugh. Excuse me, guys. I'm just gonna... Attack this right here. Yeah! Kill the Arl! Kill Arl How! That's something everybody can get behind. A human lord hunts his vanguard. Show him what we know of death. Let's go. Oh! Medical supplies. Hold up. Why are you walking so slowly suddenly? Oh! Guard dog, huh? Oh no! Oh, that's why I said oh no. <laughs> Arl How is right here! Oh no, the genlock! The genlock! Can we heal it? <laughs> oh, that was a very bad throw. Okay, if you're gonna die anyway, let's just stomp. Yeah, you were gonna die anyway, right? Like, grab Arl How. Do you wanna grab him? Yeah. We still have a whole bunch of other- Oh, the Genlock wasn't even on my team. It was like a random Genlock following us. Which I'm still sad about dying, but... Not the biggest of issues. Oh yeah. Arl How getting a beating. No! Ogre! Ogre! Please. I actually do want to keep my guys healed up. Because I want to make sure they live and all that, you know? It's in our benefit that they live anyway. Uh, you have an injury. Because if we get new ones, we have to start the approval meter all over again. Oh no! The, the ogre! Damn! Damn! Okay, I was just... Wow, okay. No more Mr. Nice Dark Spawn. I'm, I'm here to heal oh, for blood. Fallen thralls. Dead thralls cannot be resurrected and are automatically removed from the party. Use the enthrall talent to get new dudes. Arl How is unexpectedly... Yeah, he's a rogue. We know rogues are kind of crazy. But he's not infallible. No, 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 no. I wanted to enthrall one of the um, newer ones. Saw Sword. Better than what I have right now. Thank you, a gift. Shouldn't have. Yeah. Battle trophies. You found a battle trophy to give this item to one of your thralls, make them happy. We have to keep our own Darkspawn people happy too. The gates are ours, Vanguard. We must press deeper into the city's heart. 
should I make him mine? He's already kind of hurt. Sir Cothrian! Sir Cothrian. Hey, we're kind of hurt. We never got a chance to have a break. Everyone's still like... Yeah, because the battle's been continuous, so we couldn't get any health. Come on, dude. This guy's dying. Sir Cothrian's gonna kill him! Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay, Genlock, are you alright? Can you get this dude first? Oh, that Genlock's gonna die. Damn it. Herlock, me and you. The gift probably helps us get the abilities faster. Je Herlock! Herlock! Yeah, the dark spawn, they can organize a little bit, but maybe not that much. Excuse me, pommel striking me. You're dead. You are dead. I need me some health poultices. You good, buddy? They even drop anything? What's our next goal? Rampage to the market. We have conquered the gates. Secure the market. Would be cool if we could grab a few more people before then, like that ogre! But I think as far as, uh, collecting all the objectives... Oh, let's get an archer. That'd be nice. There we go. So where are we trying to go? Go over there. Here. This way. Let's go, guys. Denarim is ours. This is the alternate timeline where my uh, my B team didn't get to hold off anybody. All right. Oh, does the ogre want a gift? Ogre. You've been such an amazing teammate for the past five seconds. I would like to gift you steel bracers. Ooh! I would like to gift you a large bone. Ooh! All right, sweet. Yeah, massive strength. Market district. Everyone's dead. Let's get him. Uh oh. Beware the ballista, Vanguard. Cut down the commander. The sapper destroys gates. Was that Arl Eamon's uh, brother, was it? The alienage gate remains. Stealthy shrieks. Oh, we have shrieks now. Okay. Hold position, Vanguard, and command Shriek to advance by stealth. Oh, but my party is full. So I'll probably have to kill somebody then. Shoot. Well, I guess I'll kill the archer. <laughs> Sorry, dude! Oh, damn! But I had to do it like this. I'm sorry, my man. So what am I... What am I doing here? Use a streak to sneak past the ballistic. Yeah, we had to execute one of our thralls. Too bad. Too bad. Alright, I got you. Just... Hit him? Overwhelm. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Leap. Overwhelm, my favorite ability to not have it done to myself. Oh, the shrieks are so scary, dude. You guys ready? You can come in now. Kill Ban Tegan. That's right, Ban Tegan. Another human lord commands his place. Break him. Uh, get around the barricade? Okay, that works. Sir Perth! Help me! 
Okay, Ogre. Be careful not to hurt people around you. Innocent man! Kill him. Kill him, especially him. Sister! Sister Theohild? The mother? They're dead. Yeah, we're killing all the civilians. Wow, their defenses are pathetic here. There's barely anybody. I almost feel bad. Ban! Another ban? Goldana! Goldana! The 15 sovereigns I gave you? It's time to pay it back. The ogre's not getting anything because it's too slow. <laughs> Gorim. Ah, Gorim! Gorim from the Dwarven Origin! My second in command? Oh man, this one kind of hurts. I think we're fine here. Oh, that's awful. Alright guys, hold. Oh, you can get the cleric. We'll get the cleric, guys. You got him? Okay, now, I'm gonna have you guys hold for a second, because I see that there is a ballista around the corner. Don't you worry, we'll get it. Oh, there's a ballista, but there's no one here anyway. What? Okay. Yeah, let's make some... Potions? What? There's nobody here. What am I afraid of? Nothing. You guys doing alright? Uh... Attack! Attack him back, please. Shriek is crazy strong. Frightened elf? Don't worry, I'll relieve you of your misery. Where are the civilians? Come here. Oh, the cleric is still alive! Trying to hide in the chantry? Think again. Uh, is that a person? No, that's a statue. Where are y'all hiding? In the market? Where are y'all? Don't you think you can escape me? Van Tegan is here! You guys go fight him. Ogre. That'd be a good place to hurl a rock at. Overwhelm Ben Tegan. Immediately. I'm kind of focusing on him, but probably better to focus on the little dudes first. Just to get rid of them. They go much faster. Hey, hey, hey. hey, come on, get him! Quit missing! Okay, this Herlock is dying. What's going on here? Don't die on me, dude. Don't die on me. Not even if Tegan's your enemy. Could you stop missing, please? Sir Landry? Oh, dude, the Herlock is still... My Herlock! Don't you kill my Herlock! Tegan! How dare you! How dare you! You must I'm sort of stuck here. Get him! Better not kill him. Yeah! That's what I'd like to say. Screw off, Tegan! Redcliffe shield? Screw that. Herlock, I'm not letting you die. You're my buddy. We've been through thick and thin. Genlock Sapper will destroy the alienage gate. Vanguard, lead him there. I'd like some health potions, thanks. Why are there still so many clerics around here? Get him! Get him! 
And there- oh, come- thank you, thank you. Come over here. There's an archer over there, too. How many more? One more. Where are ya, buddy? Where are ya? Sir Landry? I don't even remember a Sir Landry. Where did you come from? Literally the house? I'm sorry, you weren't important enough for me to remember. Yes, everyone's happy. Heard a woman's voice just now. Yes. Death blow. Okay. Sapper. Sapper, come with me. Come destroy the alien edge gates. Oh, does that mean I have to sacrifice somebody again? Wait, that's insane though, because I love my party. I've got my trusty herlock. Ogren! Okay, that might actually be kind of hard. Oh, this is a. Oh, all right. Hold, guys. Drunk. They just came out of the bar. Well, that didn't hit anybody. <laughs> Sorry, Herlock. Oh man, but Ogren is formidable. The Shriek is the best one though, I think. It's crazy strong. Let's get the drunks. My main dude. Maybe somebody will fall in battle and I won't have to worry about them anymore. Overwhelm him. Town drunks. Oh no! Who died? The Herlock died. I'm so sorry, man. I'm so sorry, but we needed space for the sapper anyway, I guess. Sorry, Ogren. Goodbye. Ogren. That's just a regular codex, right? Oh, he was a decorated and highly respected warrior of the dwarven city of Orzammar, until his wife, the Paragon Branca, made him into a cuckold. <laughs> Ogren turned to drink, then accidentally killed a young noble while intoxicated. After the dwarves stripped Ogren of his pride and weapons, he left for the surface. He settled in at the Nog Noble Tavern in Denerim, ranting about his glory days to anyone who would listen. People of Ferelden. Oh. Sir Cothrian, Terran Loghain's trusted second in command, always suspicious of Alistair, but she supported him anyway. Goldana, Alistair's sister. She smelled of sour milk and cabbage. Rendon Howe, the hereditary Arl of Amaranthine. He was behind the destruction of Castle High Ever, which we know to be true. Sir Landry, knight of King Caelan. He believed that the Grey Wardens were to blame for the king's death. I don't even remember him. <laughs> Where did he come from? Mother Perpetua. The mother of the Denerim Chantry. Sir Perth. Arl Eamon's knight. He was sent on a quest for the urn. Ben Tegan. Younger brother of Eamon. Sister Theohild. The priest. Too bad. You're all gone. You're all gone. Maybe because there was no... Is Wellens alive in this timeline? Because maybe they were missing a person to really just unify them. Ogren's still here. The people are still here, but no one's unifying them enough. Okay, buddy. Alienage? One alienate. One. What? What's happening? City guards again? Oh. Sapper will work now, Vanguard, but the humans bring new weapons. Destroy them. Oh. 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 Mabari Warhound? What? We can't grab the hound. You done? Oh, wait, it's out of our party now. Should I grab a new herlock? 
I'm not gonna grab it too early because we might have to kill it. Which will end up being worse in the long run. You ready? Oh, destroy the weapons cache. A pair of merchants have resupplied the defenders. Burn the weapons cache. I see. Okay, well, let's go then. Surprisingly, we're kind of organized too. There's a knight! I'm in trouble here! Vaughn? Screw that. Oh, damn. Night no more. I can solo this guy by myself. Goodbye. Let's go, Ogre. Okay, in this case, we should probably enthrall somebody so that they're gaining the passive... ...getting some passive gains from our defeating dudes. There we go. Oh, the Ogre might be in trouble. That's a lot of dudes. We've split them off a little bit. Oh! The Shriek is where? Where are you? The Shriek is so good, my god! You guys do it? Get the knife for you. Okay, Ogre, just go elsewhere. Yeah, we're good. Let's do some like. <laughs> All out in the corner. Hold everybody. Hold. This is mine. This is mine, and mine alone. Are you serious, dude? Oh my god, that dummy. I don't know who that was, but... Wait, they didn't, they didn't die! What the?! What the hell is happening? What? Is going... Oh! Yvonne was the son of the late Arl Urien Kendalls. Left to rot in the dungeons, but he was here. Wade... <gasps> Wade and Heron escaped the massacre in the Denera Market under mysterious circumstances. A desire demon. Oh, I guess it's because they appear in Awakening, so they have to make sure that they, they don't die here. Interesting. Interesting, but also very scary. Where did that desire demon even come out of? Hey, kill it. Kill it, please. Oh, the sapper's here. Are you done? Did you guys kill it? Do stuff. Sapper has destroyed the gate vanguard, but a mage blocks the way. Let's get him then. It's kind of fun to get to try out these different abilities. Especially because our party has always been humans. But these guys, some of them walk really fast, like the Shriek. I'll get your mage. Knight Commander Regwar. Win! I am so sorry, Win. Oh! The Stone Fist! It hit me. Oh, I'm so sorry, Wynn! Man! Oh, I love Wynn! No! I mean, goodbye, mage. Sapper died. Spirit Band, can I wear a ring? I can't, but I'll be taking that. Uh-oh! Ogre's dying. Ogre... 
Can take an injury kit. I don't know if that's gonna help, though. Colin! Hey, Colin was from the Mage Tower. Oh, we got him just before he got the ogre. That's. That is a. That is an epic win! Somebody died! It was the. I think it was the Sapper. Knight Commander Gregor probably should get this dude. Oh no, the ogre! You know what though, it makes sense. They're pushing back. Some of us will have losses. I'm just sad about the ogre, mainly because I gave him so many gifts. Oh, it's just me and you left, Commander. But the ogre doesn't take potions, that was the annoying thing. Well, let's get an archer then. Let's see if we can keep going without um, enthralling any more first. Damn. Gonna miss ya, ogre. Maybe we'll get another one elsewhere. Next up, the alienage. Can't imagine there would be too much protection here. Burn their precious tree, Vanguard. Oh, wow. I don't want to get burned. We're coming in. No, 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 no. Guys, go attack the dude. I want to come in stealthily as a shriek. Like this. Thank you. These guys are not warriors. They're just people trying to defend their homes. They're not going to be that great. Okay, anybody else want to join the party? Whoa, 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 don't... Herlock Emissary, hold the phone. Come over here. Oh my god. Got ourselves a mage, guys. Can you heal? Don't think you can heal, but you can certainly do some really scary stuff. Burn the alienage. Fire bombs. Burn the alienage. Okay, everyone, come over here. Get away. And then I'll like... Firebomb the place. Is that a little bit close? Mwahahaha. Uh. Mwahahaha. Okay, let's go. You guys go first, not the mage. Am I burning? No, my weapon's burning. Get their damn tree. You wanna burn that too? We can burn the whole place after we destroy these people, or just launch a fireball or something, really. I'll launch one right at the tree right here. Uh, no, that's a little bit scary. Are people gonna get hurt? I hope not. It's a fast spell. I like it. Here we go. You guys get the dudes. Is that what you wanted? Burn, right? Is this place not burned? You want to fireball this place? That might be a little bit too much, don't you think? There we go. See, Vanguard? The elves now seek revenge. Give them death instead. Zevran. Here, I'll give you a little bit of relief after all that fire. 
You like it? Oh, shattering! Damn! Poor Zevran. Never stood a chance. Mine now. Did Zevran have special feelings for the alien niche, though? I can't remember who I brought with me in the actual thing, but I don't remember him commenting too much on it. it makes sense he'd be here for the final battle, though. Can you guys go get that? Hey, why is that still on? Is that... I'll worry about it later. Oh, it's beautiful. Just to tear people down. Frightened elves. What's new? You think the daughter of the elf lady I slept with and high ever is here? Get her. Get all of them. The defenders are a little bit stronger. Right, so I think they respawn after a while. I'm just wondering if I needed to do something at the... Oh, the leather boots. At the specified spots. Slaughter their elves. Slay them all. Raise the entire district to the ground. Elven Elder. Elven Elder no more. Get him. We good? Let's go burn down the district. Rampage the place. This place is ash, Vanguard. Come. Let us take this city's palace. Okay, we're done then. We don't have to... Um... That's it. I'll have that crate. Whatever it is. Oh! I'm sorry, but we don't let anybody go around here. Valendrian! Oh, man. Here, here's some relief. Valendrian was just some old dude, too. He wasn't even that great of a fighter or anything. Were you defending children here? Doesn't matter. We've been getting periodic updates. People of Ferelden. Valendrian, the leader, the keeper of the elven alienage, with years of experience in speaking up to defend his people when the human guards came. Zevran, the Antivan crow who was sent to kill, sent to Ferelden to kill Alistair, a Grey Warden. Alistair defeated Zevran and spared the would be assassin's life on the condition that Zevran never show his face again. Oh, I never existed. Like, Wellens Kuzlan never existed as a Grey Warden. Zevran, a fearing reprisal from the Crows for his failure, Zevran went into hiding in Denerim's elven alienage. Win, senior enchanter of Ferelden's Circle of Magi, and one of the few humans who were lucky enough to survive the Battle of Ostagar. When Alistair called for allies against the Blight, she volunteered to march to Denerim, nagging her Templar traveling companions the whole way. So is this failure basically saying that Alistair is a terrible leader? A <laughs> hundred! Faithful, did it say? Fearful. Let's get the emissary up. Probably want to keep the emissary around. Oh, you... Get some of this stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, war mage, war mage, here you go. And then you can... You, you like wine? Yeah? Yeah? You like you like uh, tribal necklaces? You like and even leather boots? Yeah. Yeah. Alienage tree? It keeps telling me to burn that place. 
Oh, that's it? Nothing? Did you want me to do something here specifically anymore? Emissary can give it another good burning. Oh! That's what I needed to do? What? You serious? I'm sorry. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Meanwhile, the other dark spawn are getting slaughtered, all because I want to do this one little thing. Palace, huh? We should be pretty close to defeating the humans. We know all the shortcuts. Kind of eerie that... I mean, obviously, from like a gameplay perspective, they're not going to make an entire new system just to play dark spawn. But they have human skills too. The mage skills, the warrior skills. You could read it as because they were previously the Winter Mages. Is Logan around? Oh. Oh no! Okay, so this still happens because. Riordan? He's competent. But what about Alistair? Same can't be said for him. Don't worry, Master, I'm coming! I'm coming to get you! All we have to do is kill the Grey Wardens! And we'll be able to end the world! Bye bye. These gates stand in your way, Vanguard. Oh, we can smash them. Thank you, Archdemon, for telling me. But I like my party. Again, I like my party. Free the ogre. You guys do your thing. I, uh, I'll play the mage, maybe. I am wounded, Vanguard. Open the gate that traps the ogre and hurry to me. Kunari mercenaries? Fried Kunari mercenaries is more like it. Okay, we can do petrify plus shatter. Actually, never mind. I only have stone fist. That's fine. Oh, I have healing, by the way. I can heal people. Hmm. Did nothing. Shriek! Come over here. I know you're good. The Shriek is so strong, my god. It's actually scary. Your path is blocked, Vanguard. Ogre's gate opens from the other side. Yeah, yeah, but I gotta kill some people first. Look at this! Fast, hard-hitting... They're beautiful! They're a war machine! Alright. Don't even need these health poultices. Take them anyway. So the gate is blocked from this side? Yeah, we don't need to loot. Get him. Get him. You wanna play? Even overwhelming them might be a waste of time. That's how crazy they are. Do you wanna heal the other dudes? The dude's not in our party. Yeah. Well, let's go. Dwarven Legionnaire! Oh, they're on to me. They're on to me. Am I gonna be okay? 
I think so. Power of many. The... Yeah, something about power of friendship and all that. Easy peasy. Who's that? Cardole. Cardole was, a uh... Oh, the Legion of the Dead leader, right? I think so. Let's get this one first. Oh. You're all not good enough. I'm sorry. There's too many. You can't defeat us. Save some of these dudes, maybe. I'm not gonna firebomb you. <laughs> you just get him. He didn't manage to kill one dark spawn before he died. That'll be your legacy then. More soldiers? Don't mind if I do. Bring it on. This is actually crazy, like the way they just cut through everybody like that. They probably have a gift. Totem. Shield of the Legion. I'll just trash it. It's garbage. We don't need you. Alright, what you got here? Uh, more dwarves? I'm so scared! Oh, that steel golem I might actually be a little bit scared of. I don't think I can overwhelm the golem. Yeah, it's not working. I think I should leave. Leave that to somebody else, maybe. Oh, whoa, can you... You know what? The Shriek can't heal either. We have to be a bit careful. Shriek is like my prized weapon right now. I've gotta make sure it stays alive. Got you, though. Herlock Vanguard, you okay? Amazing. Everyone doing good. Here we are, the gates. The gates. Yeah, the... The Shriek can only take injury kits. Injury kits gains 10 health. <laughs> Not quite... The best thing here, but better than nothing, I guess. Hello. Just gonna stand here, regain health. Sure, why not? Wait, can I not? I can't attack it. Okay. Wanna fireball it then in that case? Okay, I guess that's a story event thing. <laughs> sure. Innocent man! Get out of here. What did I do to deserve this? Not be a dark spawn? That's all. No hard feelings! Malign staff. Iron bark. A little bit better than what we have. More golems. Just hit it. Not making that same mistake twice, right? Did we get the... Oh, two lovers. We need Ogre's strength. Make him our thrall, Vanguard. Mmm, I don't know. Oh man, but I like everybody. I guess the archer I don't really care about. Didn't do anything. The archer might die naturally anyway. Here we go. Oh 
Oh yeah, we're doing good. Whoa, what is that? Blight wool. Okay, I'm sorry, Archer. You've done well. You've got to go. Sacrifice your blood for the greater good. Command the ogre to destroy the gates that keep you from me, Vanguard. Let's go. Beware the Kunari, Vanguard. He has no fear of death. The Kunari? What about that gate? We want to kill everybody, don't we? Let's kill everybody. Stand here. Now we can go in. Oh, oh, there were innocent men in there. That's innocent men and women. City folk. Yikes. You think you're gonna get me? Sergeant... Killian. Oh, that was the guy that gave us some quests in Denerim, I think. You got all of them? Good job. No innocent person goes escaped. Uh, Knight Commander Gregor, leader of the Templars. He brought many people to the defense. Cardal, experienced member of the Legion of the Dead. He met Alistair in the Deep Roads and promised to fight the Darkspawn alongside him. Sergeant Killian, member of the Denerim Guard, tasked with maintaining order in the market. Because the superiors did not think the post important, they sent Killian a progression of ever more incompetent new recruits, usually the bastard sons of minor lords. Getting um. Very nice list of people just dying here. Very good. Very good. Special people probably have a little bit better loot. That we're not gonna keep anyway because nothing is carrying over. <laughs> that's, that's garbage. Let's go. Shriek is so good. I wish I could be a Shriek all day long. Hey, if a if a dark spawn guy came up to me and was like, "Hey, Grey Warden, you want to become a want to become one of us?" and you showed me a shriek, I might be tempted. Hey, we gotta be careful. Yeah, that golem is actually. We gotta go. I think we gotta go. It's actually a little bit scary. Good thing we have the stealth skill, huh? That's the trade-off. We're not getting the heal. Okay, the ogre's dying because everyone's focusing on it. Do you not have group heal, my dude? Why don't you have group heal? Because you're not a spirit healer, that's why. It's fine. Everybody who can use a potion, just use a potion, please. The ogre might die immediately. It's too hard to manage, and we can't, like, let's get it to walk away. Can we save it? Heal is on cooldown. Get the Legionnaire? Almost strike. Okay, there's more people there. We really shouldn't be going in. Because the Ogre's gonna die. I think it's gonna die. Oh well, I suppose. There's just too many things going on here, oh my gosh. 
Can you heal the ogre? A little bit. Nice, I suppose. Oh, the ballista guy. Gotta get the ballista guy. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, I can't believe we did it. Ogre's alive too, that's crazy. Insanity. Hurry up, heal up. Everybody regroup, loot a little bit. The health poultices do actually come in handy. Do you guys talk? It's like Pokemon noises again. Okay, we're all healed up. Let's go. Last stretch, right? Basically retracing the same maps that we saw in the, you know, when we were playing as well as. Except we're winning. The Dark Spawn are winning. Okay, you guys go in. I'm gonna go in too. Ballista people! Oh, I should have seen this beforehand. Shoot, I can't get behind. Can I get it? I'm sh oh, oh my god, I'm shooting the ballista at my own guys even more. Okay, I can do that at least, but the, the barricades are blocking me. Pretty sure I shot my own guys like 20 times just now. <laughs> The emissary needs some healing. And then if the emissary could also heal some people... Oh, maybe not. Are there any other ballistas around here that I should go get? Stan! Stan is in the distance. Stan is using a bow and arrow, that's actually quite new to me. Yeah, the ogre is actually killing us more than helping because the skills are all AoE. Oh, there's a ballista here. What are you getting though? Your your ballista's not getting anybody. They're shooting. They're using the ballista, but it's not even aimed at anything proper. Heal the ogre! Oh! Oh, the emissary's dead! Oh no, that's really bad for me. Not that I was using its healing abilities that much, but it was nice to have around, you know? It's okay, as long as I still have the streak, I'm okay. Stan, I won't forgive you for this transgression against me. Dude! Ogre, please, be careful about where you're hitting. See, if we had Cone of Cold and all that, that'd be so good. I hope we get another Emissary later on. Oh, it's killing... Okay, the Ogre's dead. Which... Sure. Like I said, as long as the, the streak is alive, I'm alive. Can you guys hurry up and kill the freaking... Good lord, you're taking like 20 years. I don't want the... Stan can't look at me. Stan has gotta stop looking at me. Oh my god. Guys! We might die here. We might die. Oh! It's getting like mega laggy too. You could probably use an injury kit. Guys, I need help. Oh, another ogre, thank you! Thank you, help, help! Help, dude! 
Oh, my main dude is dead. I just realized my vanguard's dead. That's insane. Wait, is that even possible to continue this then? Because I guess my vanguard will come back, but... Uh, hello? <laughs> okay, we actually overestimated our abilities a little bit here. Can someone help me? Why are you all being useless? Oh my god, are you serious? Wow, okay. All of you useless dark spawn! Sten, I've got you now. Goodbye. Hurry to me, Vanguard. Oh yeah, I've got all your stuff. It's all mine now. Sten was a soldier of the Barisad, the vanguard of the Kunari. He was sent to Ferelden to investigate the threat of the Blight, but Sten and his brothers-in-arms were ambushed by the Darkspawn one night. Only Sten survived. He chose not to return to Parvolin. Ah, Parvolin! With his report, but lingered instead to fight the Blight and to uncover the secrets of Ferelden's sweet, crumbly baked goods. <laughs> the cookies? Not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, there's still a little bit down here. Hold up. Before we storm the palace, I'm just gonna help out my friends real quick. Yeah. Free the Shriek! Of course we're freeing the Shriek. Let's go. Honestly though, most of the time, the ogre is more of an annoyance because it really... It attacks everybody around. Hey, 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 hey! All these silly people. Hey, welcome to the party. Let's go. More shrieks the merrier. Shrieks are so good, like, it's unbelievable. They walk so fast, they attack so hard, but I guess they're a little bit fragile. It's, um, a rogue kind of thing, right? But not that fragile, really. Fragile, but not that fragile. Into the palace. We're coming, master! We're coming! The warden and his companions flee, Vanguard. Pursue them, Vanguard. And save me. Oh, I saw Morgan just now. Was that Liliana? Oh, they're coming in, they're coming in. Riordan! One of the wardens still lives, Vanguard. He must not find me. Dude, you're kind of gigantic, Master. No offense, but... I don't think they'll have trouble finding you. <laughs> Riordan was a Grey Warden from Orlay. While on a diplomatic mission, he was arrested by Terran Loghain and held in the dungeons of the Arl of Denarim's palace, Alistair Freedom, temporarily doubling the number of living wardens in Ferelden. Mmm. Everything that we did, Alistair has to do himself, but we know that he feels very uneasy about the whole leadership stuff. To me, Vanguard! Defend me with your life! Oh! Ah! Vanguard! Destroy the Warden King before he undoes us all! Alistair! Barkspawn! Ah, oh, Liliana! And it's Morgan in the distance! I can't... Oh, I can't kill Liliana. Or Morgan. That's the best of what I can do here, maybe. Did I get frozen? Pinning shot it. Liliana, don't do this to me. Oh, Alistair's been grabbed. Shove off, werewolf. How about that? Is Alistair the only one who matters? Maybe not. Liliana, don't! Don't. I'm gonna keep my shriek alive. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Damn it, didn't get either of them. Resisted. Bark spawn is kinda. <laughs> Bark spawn. You wanna join our side, Bark spawn? You have the name for it. Oh, the emissary's gotta live.
You've gotta live, buddy. We can do stuff like Winter's Grasp. Oh! Did Morgan just die? Oh my gosh. Morgan was the daughter of Flemeth, the legendary witch of the Korkari Wild. Flemeth forced Morgan to accompany the Grey Warden Alistair in his battle against the Blight, but Morgan and Alistair did not get along. She enjoyed laughing at his every mistake and followed him only for the entertainment value. That's sad. Without a mediator in between, they were kind of just... They just never really got anywhere. Here you go, buddy. Oh, Alistair is getting eaten! Do you even need me, Master? I feel like you're doing pretty good on your own. Goodbye, Bark Spawn. I don't know what this streak is trying to do with this stuff, but it doesn't even matter. Yeah, we're hanging in there. Bark Spawn didn't get an entry. That's so sad. Are you serious? Rude! Rude. Oh, I don't want to kill Liliana. Are you serious? Uh... He's resisting. Ogre? You better not do any AoE thing, okay? Master! Master! Don't you worry. Oh, the Vanguard's dead! Shoot. We want to be careful then. Oh no! <laughs> That's the opposite of what I wanted to happen. Good thing it went away pretty fast, but yikes. Mm, drain life? Oh, Shriek! You gotta live, buddy. Oh, the, dr the dragon is kind of killing us, too. Is Liliana still around? Oh my god, did she die? Well, I don't want to be the one to kill her. So that, that might be okay. Maybe let's get the lackeys. Because getting the lackeys means that Alistair will get swarmed by like 20 people. Yeah, like right now. I don't have to do anything, right? Oh! Oh man. Oh man! Oh, Lord. Goodbye. Alistair got the help of the werewolves. Oh. Oh. I didn't see a codex entry for Liliana. Maybe that's for the best. Oh. Oh my- Whoa! Damn. Well, there you have it. The last of the DLCs. Honestly, story-wise, that was basically nothing. Although it does make me a little bit worried about stuff like, Hmm, how is Alistair gonna do after he becomes king? <laughs> because as a Grey Warden, he wasn't doing that great. But as a king, he'll have people helping him, Eamon and all that. Strangely cathartic, though. This was fun in a sort of, um, I am the god of a world kind of mechanical gameplay way. Especially after Golems of Amgarak, where it was kind of hard and a little bit annoying. This one was like, I am a Shriek god and I can claw at some innocent people and kill them in one swipe. Swipe, swipe, swipe. So in that way, it was sort of, um, it's a great, more chillax sort of way to end off. And now we can wipe the slate clean because god, we don't want this to happen, right? Everybody dying and where the hell was I? I just died at High Ever or during the joining or wherever else. Alistair never got the support he needed. And I don't even know he managed to get people to help him, but it wasn't... It just wasn't working out. Okay, last thing we're gonna do is fill out Dragon Age Keep. In importing our saves across all the games, I guess it's because the games are too old or something and things just don't... They're not compatible directly. When we go from Dragon Age Origins to 2, we can import it, but from 2 to Inquisition, my understanding is that it's not possible without using this tool here called Dragon Age Keep. What it does is we're going on a website to fill out our decisions to prepare our save in the future for the third game. 
Because probably by the time I finish Dragon Age 2, I'm not going to remember the little things I did in Origins, right? So better to do it now, okay? I did have a look at this beforehand already, just to see how it works. I have to pick my person, which would be a human warrior noble. I guess my name doesn't matter, huh? I don't think you can change the name here. Let's see, Kuzland. Elissa Kuzlin, Human Noble Warrior. It's my hero. Oh, I can change the name. Okay, cool. Wellens. Sweet. The hero of Ferelden was a younger daughter of Bryce Kuzlin, Terran of High Ever. When Arl Rendenhaus forces attacked Castle Kuzlin and murdered most of the Kuzlin family, the hero escaped to safety with Grey Warden Commander Duncan, who then recruited her into the Order. Wait. Did I save it? I didn't. <laughs> okay, so how, how do I... There you go. There you go. Choose this hero. And I did not die killing the Archdemon. Alive and well. This is kind of crazy to me though, like I, I honestly expected all of us to always die, but the fact that we can be alive is kind of crazy. The Warden is alive and well. That's a big decision. Now, in terms of, like, uh, let's see, companions. No one romance? That's not true. We picked... Liliana. Liliana's song captured... What did it say? Liliana's song captured the Warden's heart. Oh, that's a sweet way to put it. Aw. Morgan shared a true bond with the Warden. The Warden and Alistair grew together despite the trials they faced. Now I like this one. <laughs> okay. Recruited dog, of course. Didn't recruit? What kind of a monster doesn't recruit dog? Stalwart, ferocious in battle and delighted by tummy rubs, dog was a companion to the warden. I guess I can't change the name. That's fine. Persuaded revered mother to- hold on, did you move across already? Uh, okay, sure. Persuaded revered mother to free Sten. Did we? Or did we steal the key? Intimidated? No, I think we pers- We had a lot of trouble, actually. I don't quite remember this one. I remember the persuasion didn't work. Did I pick the lock? Okay, a uh, bit of an ambiguous situation because I didn't actually persuade the mother myself. It was Liliana who did it. The revered mother in charge of Lothering's Chantry was persuaded to release a Kunari warrior into the Warden's custody. Sure. See, I can't even remember the little details now, let alone after I finished Dragon Age 2. Recruited Sten? Yes. Sten joined the Warden's group. I did return his sword? Return his sword? Mm-hmm. And, uh, should I go across or down? Low gain executed by Warden. Canonically, no. Low gain executed by Alistair, in my canon. Logan was killed by Alistair in duel. Oh, that's a little bit different, huh? Logan was killed by Alistair in a duel, or Alistair's blade ended Logan's life after the region was found guilty. I think it was this one. Logan was killed by Alistair in duel. My god. Logan being alive and well is kind of crazy to me, too. This one. And then recruited Ogren. Yes, I did. Recruited Zevran. Mm-hmm. Zevran is alive and well. He can die? Where? Oh my god. And then recruited Win. I know I don't have to click on these ones. I'm just checking if there's any alternatives, just in case. Alistair died killing the Archdemon. No. Alistair was not executed. Alistair became king. Alistair became a drunk? Oh my god. Wait, can I make this a little bit bigger? Here you go. Maybe that'll be a bit easier for viewing. Overwhelmed with burdens of both birth and station, Alistair walked away from it all. No, 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 no. He became a king. I'm not sure if it'll be a good choice, but he's a king. This choice had dependencies on other choices. In order to make your world state valid, we must adjust the following choices. Would you like to continue? What? No? 
But that makes no sense. The warden died killing the archdemon. I didn't though. But Alistair became king. What? Alistair can only become king if the warden dies? But that's not true though. Maybe I gotta go do the Morgan Dark Ritual thing first. What? Hold up. Yeah, that's that's wrong. Warden and Alistair were not lovers. No, we were not. No Alistair's mistress, my god. No. No, absolutely not. Goodbye. <laughs> Wynn is alive and well. You know, I'm thinking about it, but an awakening? How they showed Win one time, what was the point of that? Like, I don't know why they brought her back just for one little side quest. It just seems kind of silly. Liliana is alive and well, of course. <gasps> what? Killed Liliana after poisoning the urn? Oh my goodness, I'm getting... <gasps> Liliana left. Upset at the way the warden dealt with the urn, Liliana left. Oh, wow. I'm getting to see some alternate choices here just by doing this Dragon Age keep already, and it's kind of... It's kind of freaking me out. Okay, Morgan did have a baby. Old God baby. <laughs> Morgan had an old God baby with Alistair. Yes. Did not acquire Grimoire. Did the Warden find Flemeth's Grimoire for Morgan? I did. But not from her- wait, 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 you mean the real one, right? Not the one that I gave to Morrigan? Acquired Grimoire by defeating Plymouth? Yes. Defeating, not killing. Interesting wording. So can I go back to the- Right, Alistair's king. Yeah, bit of um... That was a bit of a weird one there. Are we good? Morrigan had a baby with Alistair, got the Grimoire. I think that's good. Alright, sweet. And the next section, the prologue. Ostagar prisoner left alone. No? We... did not kill him. We fed him stolen food? No, he pooped it out. We didn't steal the key from him. <laughs> Pretty sure we got the lunch willingly, right? We didn't steal the food. The Warden convinced the guard to share his lunch with a prisoner, who thanked the Warden by turning over a stolen key. That's right. Yeah. And then, cured Mabari Hound. We did. A rare white flower collected from the Korkari Wilds provided relief to the injured Hound. Yes. The Ostagar section, that's the prologue. The Urn of Sacred Ashes, uh, should we do this in the order that we played it in? Which one did we do first? The Arl? Arl of Redcliffe. Helped Redcliffe fight. Mm-hmm. Helped Redcliffe prepare. Yep. For undead attacks. And then Connor did not die. Connor alive, not possessed. <gasps> he can still be possessed? No, he's completely free. And then... Bella left Redcliffe? Bella... Bella was the bartender person, right? The, yeah, the barmaid? You know, I'm actually not sure because I don't think I... It might have been a bug or maybe I did something in a weird order, but I don't remember anything special happening with this woman. I know that apparently if I did it another way, then something might have happened, but I don't know... She was still there, I think. She was still there, so can I assume that she took ownership? Because that's the only one. In all the other cases, she... left. Okay, this is a bit of a weird one. I checked, and the bartender is still the owner, right? But she was still here too, so I don't think she took ownership of the tavern. But she was still working there, which is none of these choices. For now, I'll put this one, because, yeah, this is the only one that's... that actually has her staying at the bar. Maybe something went weird here, I don't know. Mm, did nothing to help find Bevan. Who the hell is Bevan? <laughs> Caitlin, her brother. Ah, ah, the, the sister and the brother in the Chantry. Freed Bevan. No, I did find the sword. Freed Bevan and found the sword. Their family sword. Freed 
Bevan and returned sword. Did I return it? You know what? I don't think I returned it, actually. Because I, I said to them, hey, uh, here's your sword back. And then the lady was like, oh no, you should keep it because you're, you can make better use of it. So I took the sword. Yeah, this is about vowing to return it afterwards. I didn't return it, though. I remember saying that I would never sell it because it was somebody's stuff. Uh-huh. Never rescued Owen's daughter. No, I did. I did. That was the blacksmith. Wow, these are pretty fine. These choices are pretty minute. Isolde is alive. And well. Thank you. So that was Redcliffe. Good. And then the next one we did was what? The Circle Tower. Which one is that one? Mm, nature of the Beast, I guess? Wait, what the hell is this? I don't remember any of this. What is this? Oh, oh, oh this is a Brazilian forest. Okay, we can do this. Sure. They are together. Yes, uh, <laughs> the, the couple's together. No, I didn't like, you know, randomly try to bed the young elf or anything like that. Brokered peace between the werewolves or the Dalish. Sided with werewolves. Brokered peace. Yes, the Dalish joined the warden's forces. The werewolves were cured. Didn't tell Athras about wife's fate. Um... I think I did tell him, right? Wow, I don't remember this at all. Okay, I did tell him. I told him that she was a werewolf. Try to spare him, but he deserved to know the truth. Varathorn Ironbark. I did bring this to the blacksmith or uh, the crafter. Mm -hmm. Could not help Elnora. Or uh, El Elora. Elora. No, 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 we did. We did. <gasps> no, we did. Didn't encounter Dagon. Dagon? Return Dagon to the Dalish camp. The Elven Scout. Uh, no, I did return him. He was an injured elf that was in the Brazilian forest, right? <laughs> I barely remember this. There we go. Paragon of her kind. Oh, broken circle. Here we go. That's the circle tower. Mages supported or Templar supported? Well, we didn't have them kill the mages. The Warden fought to the top of the tower and defeated Eldred, saving the remaining mages and recruiting them into the Warden's army. By a hair, I'm told, but we did it. <laughs> First Enchanter Irving survived the battle. Yes, he did. Did not agree to Cullen's request. Cullen's request? To kill the mages? No, we didn't. That's insane. I know he was worried as a Templar, but that was a lot of people to randomly kill. Surprisingly, not that many choices in the Broken Circle one, huh? And then Paragon of her kind. And Orzammar defeated Branca. Branca ended her own life. Oh, I defeated Branca. Balin rules Orzammar? No. Harrowmont rules Orzammar? Didn't talk to Dagna. No, we sent her to the Circle Tower. Dagna left the study. The Circle Tower did get destroyed, but she could still go. Didn't encounter Marty? Marty... Did the Warden have relations with Marty before being cast out of Orzammar? Oh, no, 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 we didn't. I don't know who Marty is. Yeah, we had relations with a elf, right? Oh my... Whoa! Didn't have son with Marty. Oh, this must be like a Dwarven noble thing, I guess? Right, because I, I wasn't even from here. I don't go here. Didn't speak to Filda? Who the hell is Filda? Oh, Ruck's mother. I lied, right? I didn't kill him. Said Ruck died. Yeah, that's what I did, I think. Oh, Didn't prove Legion of the Dead connected to Noble House. Pretty sure we did. Yes. 
Didn't look in the stolen tome. No, we did. We did. We looked into everything, basically. Return the tome to the shape root. Even though we could have sold it for money. Didn't help Burkle create Chantry. We did. And then Zerlinda remained in Dust Town. Zerlinda? Oh, the lady whose family kicked her out. Yeah, we reconciled her with the family. <gasps> That's so sad. She could have left her son on the deep roads. Chantry, okay. I don't know, though. Like, the way we convinced the father was too easy. I feel like she might get kicked out again. And that makes me scared. Didn't complete Rogex Lyrium deal. The Lyrium smuggling. No, I didn't. Because this is the one that I didn't have the, um, I didn't have the money for, right? Too bad. Would I have done it though? Probably. Didn't help Orta join the assembly. No, I did. Orta Ortan, John Johnson. Heck yeah. And then Denerim. Sir Landry alive. Who the hell is Sir Landry? I honestly don't remember. Oh, it's the guy that we met in the Denerim market for like one second. And he was all like, I bite my thumb at you, sir. And I'm like, do you really want to fight me? And then he just left, because he's like, you know what? I'll I'll kill you another day. <laughs> so I guess he's alive, even though we just killed him in the Darkspawn Chronicles. <laughs> Didn't tell Ben Seagard about Oswin? Who the hell are these people? These names! No. We told him, and yes, yes, yes. The tortured kid in the dungeon. That's right. Scroll to Sister Justine. I gave it to her. She never... No, she never gave it back to me. She said she just took it to study, and that was that. Crime wave. I did do the crime wave. Yes. Didn't help clear customers out of Pearl. Oh, like the drunken people? Yeah, I think we did that. Crimson Oars. Uh, were those other people who were kind of annoying? I'm pretty sure we did all the stuff that... Yeah, 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 we did everything for Sergeant Kylan. Alstana, her brother's ring. Did we give that? Yes, we did. What happened to him anyway? The last time we saw, he was just in the dungeon. Didn't complete Master Ignatio's assassinations. We did. Oh, we could have killed him. That might have been interesting. Get the Antivan crows on our back. The amulet to the beggar woman. We did. We did return it. At the very end. We did encounter a gold Anna. Yep. Wasn't happy, but... At least you have answers. Marjolin! We killed her. Is that it? That is it. And then, the lands meet. Oh dear. Alistair rules. I mean, yeah, he does, but, you know, not in that way. <sighs> For a second, I was like, what? We can have a lesbian marriage here? No, this is, this is a male warden. <laughs> okay, Alistair rules. Yes, he does. Sure. That's that. And then, the urn. We didn't do the urn yet, right? Urn not poisoned. No, we didn't poison it. Looks like people would have gotten really pissed if we poisoned it. Because Liliana could leave us because of that? My god. The Battle of Denerim. Alistair killed the Archdemon. Hold on. Wait, in the cutscene? In the cutscene. Oh, I let him kill, like, he got it in the gameplay cutscene, the slow-mo cutscene, but in the actual cutscene, I did it, right? But nobody died anyway because of the whole baby business, so I did it. I think. And then... Oh, okay, it just goes back. Awakening! We just did this, we did not kill the architect. Keep protected. Uh... I guess it's both? I'm actually not sure because they mentioned that the place crumbled and that the keep took five years to be rebuilt. But I think it's this one, right? I guess? Actually not sure. Nathaniel alive and well. 
Mm -hmm. The Warden. Did we reunite Ogryn with his child in Felzi? Um, they parted on... The Warden ensured that Ogryn and Felzi parted on bad terms. I guess they reunited at the end. I didn't really get the impression they were together though. It was more like a split custody kind of thing. But it wasn't... They didn't end on bad terms. So I guess it's this one. Really though? That seems a little bit wrong too. What? But what about like Sigrun and Velana and all that? That doesn't matter at all? Oh my gosh. Witch Hunt. Or right, Warden's Keep. Oh yeah, these DLCs. Hold on. Gain the power of blood. Yes, we did. We just drank some random gigantic jar. Because it was there. <laughs> and then... Sophia Dryden and Avernus. No, Avernus we did not kill. We kept him around. Yes, allowed him to continue ethical research. Sophia died, I think. Because she was basically not even alive anymore anyway, right? There's that. And then Stone Prisoner, we got Shale, alive and well. Did not recruit. <gasps> Shale died when the Warden sided with Bronca. Whoa! If you side with Bronca, she gets that mad. Matthias and Amalia both alive, neither possessed. Oh, the kitty! The dad and the daughter and the kitty. No, everybody's alive and well. Neither possessed. Shale recruited. You got it. And then... Witch Hunt DLC. Warden did not go through the Alluvia. You can go through? You can go through? What? <gasps> what? Oh my god! Wow, I wish I could have gone through. Maybe it was like a romance only thing? What the hell? But she, she didn't let me help her. Oh, wow, that's a... <gasps> wow, I didn't know that was possible. Now I kind of want to... I don't think I could have done it. Like, my character couldn't have done it. But damn, knowing that that's possible? Pretty insane. Okay, I think that's it, right? Right, so I think this is automatically saved. I don't have to do anything special. Yeah, I think if I uh, if I click on this, it plays like this uh, cutscene version of what we did here. We'll watch that maybe once we actually get to Dragon Age Inquisition. But for now, I'm just gonna leave this here. And then when we finish Dragon Age 2, I guess we'll do the same thing. And yeah, that will be it for Dragon Age Origins for now. And I will see you back eventually. Hopefully not in too long of a wait for Dragon Age 2. Let me know if I filled out anything wrong here. I did look up a lot of the smaller choices. I think it's alright, but um, yeah, the Argrin Felzi one I was kind of a little bit iffy on. But yeah, alright, see you soon. Thank you.